What is up guys, West Tech Gaming here, to an unboxing the PlayStation Platinum wireless headsets without further just go ahead and get started. Now, quick backstory, right? I did have the PlayStation Gold wireless headsets, but I felt like over time, they felt really uncomfortable in my ears. Like, you could really feel the pressure of the insides of the, the headphones, not the cushion part, the insides, which is really hard and rough. I could feel that against my ears after a couple of hours of gameplay, and I really wasn't feeling that, because my ears did feel it afterwards. Now, if I didn't really feel it too much, I wouldn't have minded. So I'm really hoping with this version, they did fix that. So to me, it looks a lot more well-designed and everything. So let's take a look at it and see what we get. So in the front, the basic presentation, we got the picture of the Platinum headsets. This is Platinum wireless headsets, PS4, 7.1, virtual surround sound. And that's kind of all the features of it. You guys see from the side. It does have microphones built in, rechargeable battery, which is always good. Companion app for cuff, with, with certain games that use the feature of the companion app. 7.1 surround sound, 3D audio enabled. And on the side, I did get this from the warehouse to use from Amazon, so that's why the box kind of looks a little bit cell taped up. So that's pretty much it. So nothing too special right there. So let's take a look at it when we open it up. Right, so, so we got another box instead of a box. Okay, so inside that box, we got another plain black box with the PlayStation logo on it. So it looks very nice presentation, like how they do that. Okay, so that's nice. This is like kind of velvet on this head. Okay, now that is sick. So we got the headsets itself. Wow, okay. They're smaller than I thought they were going to be. Because I thought they were going to be a bit bigger, these headphones. But they're actually smaller. Nice and padded, this bit does. I'm pretty impressed. Wow. It looks really good, the build quality does. And it looks very well padded. And smaller than I thought it would be. I thought it would be bigger than the gold headsets. But if not, it's actually roughly the same size as the PlayStation Gold headsets. And it has better sound on it and everything. So this is amazing right here. It looks really good, this does. I like how the headband is a lot more flexible this time, you know, compared to the other plastic design. I like this a lot. So over here, right on the bottom, we kind of do a run through the headphones. We get a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. So you can use it in other devices that have a headphone jack or you can use it on your Xbox, which I did it with my previous gold headsets. So they do work on both. And you've got a micro USB charger. Now I would have liked them to have USB-C, but it's still good that it's rechargeable and no batteries required. Over here, we've got volume up and down. We've got mute option number one and two. So this is basically to turn it on and off. Number one is just turning it on and number two is bass mode. So the bass will go up even more. That's what the other ones were like. So I'm not sure if this one is exactly the same. But over here is audio. So you can kind of change the audio over here, 3D to, to normal pretty much. That's pretty cool. And the microphones are built in over here. You can see one mic over there and one mic will be on the other side. So they're, they're actually pretty decent, they are. But if you're really into like gaming and want to make gaming videos, I would get a Yeti or something better, pretty much. But they still do the job for trying with your friends. Now, the presentation still carries on, looks really nice. It's kind of velvet, this is. Wow, this is pretty nice. And then over here, we've got another box. Let's just open this box up. So over here, is the micro USB cable and the headphone jack, which is always good. That's the instruction manuals and that's it. Now, I'm a bit disappointed that there is no case for this. Maybe there is a case since this is a used one, but with this one, I didn't get a case with it. So let me know if the other one, like a new one comes with a case or not, because this one did not come with a case at all. So that is pretty good, this is. It looks really good so far, the presentation. So let's take a look at what we got in the box and see what it all looks. So what we get in the box is the headphones itself. It really feels nice, it has that nice, you can feel the heft to it. But at the same time, they're not so overly big. Like I thought they were gonna be, I thought they were gonna be bigger than the original PlayStation Gold headsets, but they're not. They feel really sturdy, very flexible, and these feel really padded. So I'm hoping when you play games, it will not hurt your ears because this bit over here really hurt my ears afterwards. So before I forgot to mention, right, there is a dongle and it looks a lot more cooler. This one does, right, and it uh, has LED lights on it now. So this is the new dongle for this new wireless headsets. So this is how you connect it to your PS4. A lot of people were disappointed because the, it's not using Bluetooth directly to the PS4. You have to use a USB stick, but it's still good. It does the job, you know, if you don't want to use a cable. That's pretty good it is. And you can still connect it via the aux cord. So if this dies, you can still connect it to the aux cord unlike the Beats headphones. That's one thing that sucks about the Beats Studio headphones. You cannot use it with the aux cord once it dies, the power. That sucks. So I'm glad with this, 
they actually let you do that you know that's really good that is after long gaming sessions you know so that's pretty much it and you get the aux cable and you get the micro usb cable so that's really cool it is and also get the instruction manuals and that's pretty much it you don't need to go through them pretty much because pretty simplistic and easy to set up pretty much but that's pretty much it the video the playstation platinum headsets let me know what you think of this down below overall i think it's a definite upgrade from the gold ones the originals and they, they do look really good now i've not tested the sound quality yet so if you want me to do a review video of the sound quality let me know in the description down below and that's pretty much it for the video leave a like if you like this video right here subscribe to the channel if you're new and i'll catch you guys next time mm -hmm.